Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2, and we gotta go defend the Avengers, so... Uh, we brought along two new people. Also, I gave uh, Mr. Shiv what I call the unscrub weapon. It's essentially, uh, you have a 5% chance to one-hit kill stuff. So, that should be good for Mr. Shiv. Uh, so we gave, um, Pat over here the incendiary grenade. Uh, Stealth is just coming along as normal. Welcome to team, uh, our... Adam265. I'm running out of meme names, so whatever. I just That's someone else we know. He's a cool guy, so he's in. Uh, I'm the same. And we also have Kyle Katarn, who's going to be our pistol marksman. Uh, so I know it's a difficult mission, and we're like leveling up some people, but I think this will be fine, to be honest, because I think I'm super fucking strong. Uh, he's really fucking strong. She's pretty strong, and he's strong enough, so that should be good enough. I mean, you can always just reload it back in, you know, and choose some other people, I guess. Patch is gonna casually walk down the ramp. Menace one five, situation critical. Primary Avenger systems are offline and hostile. Shen, any updates? Failure. The Avenger is dead in the water. I'm diverting reserve power to the scanners, and they're picking up a powerful radiation source nearby. We need to locate and destroy whatever it is disrupting our systems. We may have a bigger problem, Commander. We're picking up heavy comm traffic. Dozens of Advent transports are inbound on our position, and they've got battleships in tow. The aliens are sending everything they've got. We have to get this ship off the ground, or we may not make it out of this one. Alright, so I can't hit anybody from here, so we're just gonna... We're gonna be pretty cautious here. Oh wait, never mind. They can see us. That's not good. All right, I think what we might do is Pat may actually Pat can just go flank from here. Heading out. Why do they always dodge grazed? God damn it. Yeah, yeah, no fucking shit. Alright, it's up to Mr. Ship, it looks like. Or maybe it's not. Kyle Katarn isn't gonna do anything. Fuck me. Guess I should have opened up with a grenade, huh? Yeah, we're not getting a flank on him. Alright, we're gonna fucking grenade his ass. I mean, the Stun Lancer I'm less concerned about, but whatever. I just don't like the Vipers, because they're going to poison people and whatever. I was hoping it wouldn't have to open up like this, but yeah. So are we still technically in concealment with our other soldier? I guess she's not anymore? I love my voice. Uh, I think with that guy we're gonna move the fuck up here. Mother. Sixty-one percent chance. Yeah, sure, why not? He's also got a five percent chance to instantly kill. Good job. Maybe you should have gotten the scrub weapon. Fucking Brayer pistol. Piece of shit. <laughs> Go, Kyle. No, come on. That's the big question. Is concealment broken? I'm assuming it is. I'm sending reinforcements in from the Avengers reserves. What? Who are you sending? Candace here? What? Why is he here? Alright. Can we just shoot that thing from all the way back here? Or oh, no, I think we still need squad side, I guess, on it. Uh, I guess minigun him. Exactly. Exactly. 
Okay, I was gonna bring Ken along because I'm like, oh, he's a bit wounded, but the game's like, uh, I think you, I think you're a fucking dipshit for not bringing along your best and brightest. Well, best maybe. Okay, Mr. Shiv, you're gonna heal up uh, Pat. And no, we're not in concealment anymore. Are they actually? Yeah, okay. So I was wondering, I'm like, they have to be activated. Alright, let's see who we got to move up with some grenades. I mean, that's. could be a job for Kant. Not a problem. Let's see, incinerator grenade range. Ah, good enough. We'll do it. We have like three grenaders now. That's the thing. We also want to get that that guy right here. Does this guy count on low ground? What the hell is that double arrow thing mean? Who even knows? That squad sight. I don't know what the double arrow means. Oh, it means he's wounded. I think actually. Missed. I think this cop can shoot people too. I mean, why not? I know this guy's impossible to hit. We're gonna move back. And Ken will move up to here, maybe? Yeah, let's move up to here. His, yeah, his health is a bit compromised, but not enough for us to care, I think. So he's clearly not happy about his little predicament. What the fuck? Oh, we have a couple more guys here. I think now it's time for the gas grenade. Mr. Shiv has a 5% chance to insta-kill, but I think he has to hit something in order for that to take effect at all. So Ken should have only two frag, well, three frag grenades actually right at this point. That's actually, it's a, it's a lot of grenades, guys. Okay. Hit and disoriented. Good job, stealth. Alright, this mission's actually not looking too good right now. I, okay, that's it. We're, we're tossing a fuck ton of grenades out this mission. Can you fucking hit something for once in your life, Mr. Shiv? Holy fuck. As much as I want this loot. Oh, we could get this and then go back. Actually, let's do that. Let's get this. Grab the item. Grab the item. I guess when you're disoriented, you're not allowed to pick up the item. Okay, you're not allowed to pick up items when you're disoriented. Fine, I'm gonna load the game then, back to the beginning of this, cause fuck that. I was gonna basically make her pick up the item and then sword the guy uh, with her return thing, but she can't do. She cannot do either thing. Apparently, that's like a, apparently that's super special of an option. All right, uh, if we want this item, we're gonna have to get it right now. So Kyle can get it. Moving the designated coordinates. What kind of weapon you hit there? Alarium core. All right. Tech guys allow this. That's affirmative. All right. What's your chance to hit on this guy? Oh, not the worst chance to hit in the world. I would rather she kill the person right next to her. Tch, <laughs> full damage. Alright. So, things are not looking terrible. Yes, you definitely did. 
All right, we're gonna lob some gas grenades out and shit. Where's Pat right now? We can move him up here. Absolutely. Now you're saying, don't be why, Miker? Why are you being so aggressive? Because they're all gonna be fucking dead. Right there. That's the sweet spot. Go at him. Okay, that guy's dead, that guy's dead, that guy's... Dead. Ah, that's a really nice gas grenade. Alright, that leaves one left. Advent Trooper. What do we have to deal with him? We got canned with three grenades. Three motherfucking grenades. Yeah, I think we're gonna deal with, deal with him right now. He's a fucking stun lancer, which I cannot actually deal with him like this. Maybe he will do it? Uh. Yeah, okay. We're gonna grenade him out. And then we're gonna shoot at him. So I wonder what the other shot that I have is. I don't actually have that shot. Can can also take a shot, but we're gonna just overwatch him. It's now 93%, so might as well. Exactly. Uh, now they're less likely to go into... I'm sending reinforcements in from the Avengers reserves. I want fucking re reinforcements are we gonna get? Who do we have now? Is it Zen? Oh shit, it's Zen. Fucking, okay, he's got like only one med kit? Oh my god, I should've given him more fucking med kits. Whatever, just heal that person. Gremlin, medical detail. Actually, we only have one med kit for the entire squad. I forgot about that. Alright, so Pat may want to deal with that. Okay, so I think Kyle can actually shoot the... Um... No, he can't. Because we're trying to figure out... We're trying to destroy this guy, right? Apparently, squad sight isn't enough for that. Got incendiary grenade. Don't want to use that quite yet. Where's canned? Hand is right here. Okay, this is some nice cover for him. That works out really well. Uh, no, I want you to f throw a grenade. Actually, apparently that was completely different. Surprise. I love surprises. So we keep just getting single soldiers, like, every couple seconds. Uh, we're gonna want to incinerate those guys, I think, but... I think we don't have much of a choice right now, because these... Well, it's 70, there's a 72% chance to hit this guy, so let's get this guy, then. He, sh he chose some poorly with his cover. Is Adam already out of grenades? Apparently he is. Affirmativo. Try and get him. Postil neutralizado. Se me está acabando la munición. All right. Overwatch that, Mr. Shiv. Can maybe boop up. 58%. Overwatch. Kyle can not shoot him very well either, so... He doesn't even have long watch, though. But he has a, he has a smoke grenade. Probably not the best opportunity to use it right now, though. Covering now. And Zan will move up into some kind of cover. Okay, I'll go. Doesn't die immediately. Okay, there's enough people in... in cover here. So I, I'm just, I think it's just gonna be a constant. Oh wow, okay. The nice shotgun shot. 
apparently you had a really violent death. Enemies moving on our position. All right, here's our constant reinforcement barrage. The situation just got worse. Resistance outposts are reporting enemy transports on the move across this region. They're getting ready for an all-out assault. Uh, I'm kind of worried about this. Stealth should be the one to move up. I'm trusting you here. Okay, the two snipers can take out that little terminal thing. But they have to be the ones to do it. Apparently we're still not in range. If you say so. Okay, now we can see it. We have visual confirmation on the disruptor. Destroy it and let's get the hell out of here before it's too late. So, I don't uh, when I do dead eye, apparently there's no aim penalty on this guy, so I'm just going to do 13 damage to it. We can just finish it off with Kyle. What now? Target destroyed. Excellent work, Menace One Five. Shen, what's our status? Whatever it was, destroying it seems to have lifted the disruption field. Engine control systems are coming back online. We should be clear to take off within 60 seconds. Commander, we can take off on your order. We should get the squad on board and get moving. All right, but we're gonna have to cover our retreat here. Monto la guardia. Mostly we need our, um, we need hey, her to come make a big sprint back. I guess that'll be okay. What's it, what's this? Lift off Avenger. Activating will abandon all soldiers not in the fucking escape zone. Where is the escape zone? This is the escape zone, so we gotta just bring everyone back here. Alright, so I'm gonna make myself long watch in just a second. On my way. This is actually a really cool mission though. Got it Did I mention already that that cutscene is really cool too with the fucking Avenger getting its ass wrecked? And they actually brought a mech trooper here. I've been troops here. All right, we should have enough Overwatch to deal with this. Except, no, he didn't move up far enough. All right, how far can Stealth run? Stealth can get pretty far. Apparently, no, we can't see him. What else do I have? Oh, dude, we got kill zone. That's right. Holy shit. All right, dude, we're totally trying this out. Actually, wait, let's reload first, and then can we kill zone? No, we can't. Okay. I didn't have enough ammo to do it anyways. We got a smoke grenade, too. Let's take a shot at this guy's ass. Come on, Kyle. Yeah, channel the inner Brayer pistol. You glorious motherfucker. Alright, let's add him. Your ship's gonna have to move back. I think he's gonna sprint back, actually. Kand also needs to come back. But he can sprint back to the point as well. Aid protocol, somebody. Okay, next turn we can we can pull out, so. Oh come on, Adam. We had so much more faith in you. La próxima vez le doy. Advent reinforcements inbound. We're almost out though. Be advised, we've picked up hostile reinforcements inbound on your position. Ya me ocupo. Okay, I'll go. It's actually kind of neat how you just pull out everyone Hang like this. Now. I actually kind of like this. Confirmed. It's a neat mission. There's a lot of Pat Packet in here. Double time. 
Alright, see what it says now. So we're gonna lift off Avenger. This is the extraction zone, right? Yeah, so we're all in here. Yeah, oh, there you go. So it's zero. So we're good. Excellent work, Commander. Looks like the Avenger lives to fight another day. Oh, that wasn't so bad. It brought out some people occasionally to basically uh, help us out. It was actually a pretty neat mission. <laughs> Gravely wounded. Oh, there you go. Adam got his level up. I still like the shredding armor. It's still really nice. And that's pretty much it. Everyone else is wounded. Larev Core, good job. All right, well, now we learned what that's all about. And how much supplies do we have? Not enough. I don't remember what I was doing last time. I think I was doing this convoy thing. Let me just uh, save it quickly before I continue that. Because I think I, oh yeah, I want to make that giant machine gun. Avenger plotting new course. Because we're going to have to do some uh, uh, avatar project stuff after we get this minigun. Oh, we got the skull jack. Skull mining. As if the skull jack itself wasn't invasive enough. He has a new, more thorough means of extracting information from the advent soldier's chips. This new skull mining technique could lead to new intel gains from our enemies. I can upgrade our skull jacks to significantly enhance the ability of any soldier carrying one. Oh, cool. Let's see what that's all about. Is that in the proving ground? Uh, yeah, it is. Requires a lot of supplies, though. Let's get more experimental grenades, though. Uh, you can just, like, all the time just be making something. Good, Commander. I'll let you know as soon as the project is ready for deployment. So, I, I, I should mention, though, that this is probably not the best place for the workshop, because if I made it here, and then, like, I could have made, like, four things have the machines, but that's okay, whatever. Blind run, whatever. I, d I didn't plan it out accordingly, what can I say? Incoming message for you, Commander. Patching it through to your quarters now. You have made considerable progress against the aliens over the past month, Commander. I hope that your ongoing efforts will only lead to further success. All right, let's see. Advent invests in improving their battle gear, adding armor to some of their soldiers in the field for a month, or they're on high alert. And then there's the hidden event once again. Oh, there's a new alien facility construction is imminent. Uh, ignore for now. Is it three days on that? Alright. Uh, we now have enough for that minigun, finally. Hey, Commander. Hi. Uh, I want to make this... Apparently I need 150 supplies. But I'm hoping we find a few more recruits who can handle a wrench. Oh, the supplies I have to get it over here. Whatever. These findings will likely prove crucial to our ongoing efforts, Commander. So we got 43 intel from that guy. All right. Let's uh, maybe get the uh, facility lead. Cuz I think we're starting to get to the point where I think we want to do that. Also, there is psionics. Uh, maybe we should research that, but that's 13 days. And let's, let's do this. Fucking do this. number of valuable applications stemming from this technology. I'll have a report assembled as soon as the research is complete. Strategic resource located. 59 fucking supplies. Wow, what a waste. Alright. Some intel over there. Avenger plotting new course. I spent six days on that. Dude, UFO, just get off my deck, okay? The outcome of this research can only further our advances, Commander. We just got the facility mission in Africa, really? Okay. Oh, I guess we'll do the. Uh, I do want to do plated armor at some point. Okay, let's do armor and then psionics. And fuck the rest of this. I mean, I mean, alien encryption is eventually going to be something we want to do. I had assumed you'd make that research a priority, Commander. I'll notify you as soon as the report is available. I mean, people aren't dying yet, but still. Let's finish this guy off. New new staff are available. Veteran soldiers as well. Uh, let's see what that. Let's see what that's all about. United States. Welcome, Commander. 
So we do rapid construction. Uh, and then there's medical assistance. An engineer and thing. I think they're more expensive right now. Or no, no, they will be more expensive. They're preparing to make it. Or maybe not. I, I remember they were they were thinking of making stuff more expensive for us. Or something. Maybe that's like the hidden event or something. I don't know. I forgot what that was about. That's okay. Commander. I am the commander. And I want a mag cannon. And I would love uh, the mine shield. Is looks like shit. So, but who knows? Because that's a total fucking wasted slot. We want the mimic beacon. Yes, ma'am. And I think the rest of this is fine. All right. So now we're at the point where we can either make these things, which 108 and 72. Which would be kind of nice. All armor and vest proving ground projects are completed instantly. See, that will be nice to get early on. But on the other hand, we can do this alien facility thing. Black market. So we can set back the dark event thingy above. Which, uh, you know, maybe that might be actually kind of good. Let's see, um, let's see how many soldiers we have for this. Uh, we got seven wounded, or sorry, five wounded. Uh, lightly wounded, one day. Dan, and Canned. And Pat, uh, kind of want them to, to be here for that. Maybe I should put someone in the Advanced Warfare Center. But they're all busy, all my engineers. Oh well, rip. Totally want to get suited up though. Can make contact. Let's see. Commander, now that we've established contact with the local resistance, we've got the details we need to move on the aliens' facility. This is our chance to set back their work on the Avatar project. We're and we're not at that point yet, so let's just go scan for intel. Interception again. Setting course for Sector Eight, Mexico. Are we going to Mexico? We're in the clear, Commander. No further sign uh. of the pursuing UFO. Avenger plotting new course. Okay. I'm like, dude, we're doing like two in a row. I'm like, fuck that shit. We can also start doing Brazil. Oh, here we go. Actually, we can see what the bonuses are. All GTS tactic costs are reduced by 50%. Oh, shit. Dude, I didn't realize we could do this. And new Artec, what are the things here? Plus five to Avenger power. What does Africa give me? Well, we could, we can't know. You'd have to go over there. Dude, I, I don't want to go here. This place sucks. Asia is terrible. Nah, it's actually okay. So let's, let's just continue the, the supply drop here. Commander, the aliens have made significant progress toward their goals. New advent facilities are cropping up around the world. That's fine, don't worry. We'll set them back soon. New targets for our guerrilla operations against advent. Okay, let's see the targets. Uh, just, uh, we can either get a ranger, uh, or we can get a scientist. And we can get rid of the counter, the dark event. But what dark event does this counter? Vigilance. Or New Mexico. The hidden event. Oh, that's right. I, I countered the hidden event uh, the hidden event before. That's what I did. So maybe we'll get the scientists this time. Also, that there's the fucking difficulty, which also kind of matters. So we would be essentially choosing the more difficult one for the scientist. But that would be easier to kill, I guess. I don't know. The detection radii it hasn't really been a huge issue for me. Um... It's either supplies or scientists, and I think I'm going to go with the scientists this time. It kind of seems nice. Uh, we will do that. For the Western US Precinct. I kind of like the new system of the, the dark event projects that we have. So, trust me, the facility is on the agenda. one of our troops equip the Skulljack for use in the field if we're going to make any progress towards our current objective. What does the Skulljack look like, I wonder? There it is. 
Uh, it can. It requires melee range to activate. Um, it's a melee item requiring the user to be adjacent to the to the target. Ah. Oh. There's also the mimic beacon. So, who? What are we trying to? I'm just use use a skulljack on the advent officer. Okay. So that's that's what we're actually trying to do right now. So when we see have an officer, we'll probably use it on him. But anyways, that's it for now. Uh, so remember, we will be watching. <laughs>